Hello Maurice, how are you? My name is Tamiris, welcome back to my channel and I am sick again. I had COVID in the first week of October and now I'm just sick all over again. So I decided to just get ready, see if a little bit of makeup will make me feel a little bit better. So that's it, what we're doing today. Let's go. My voice is really rough, so I'm really sorry, but I wanna record this and put some makeup on my face, make me feel a little bit pretty, even though I'm very sick. And I am going to start with the Rare Beauty Primer. It's the Illuminating Primer. I love this primer. I use it a lot. Definitely gonna have to buy another one of this primer soon. I just really like the glow that this primer leaves on my skin. So pretty. You know, it's been a while since I used the Rare Beauty foundation, so I'm gonna use it today. I really don't remember the last time I used this foundation. I like it a lot. Oh, I think it's too light for me now. I am still a little bronze from my vacation that I did in Brazil I was like at the beach for two weeks I think got very bronze so this may be too light but we'll see how it turns out I'm just gonna land here with a makeup sponge maybe that's why I haven't used this foundation in a while because it is so life for my complexion right now oh my god this is my winter foundation because in the winter I don't get bronze and I'm very white especially in New York it's very cold and um snowing so you know you don't get any sun damage and you just are very pale but oh my god i'm gonna brighten it up with a uh, bronzer because otherwise i'm gonna be looking like a ghost that was not the idea i'm gonna use the bright beauty bronzer this is becoming a very beauty only brand video but i will use other brands i promise I really like this bronzer, it blends like butter very easily. Don't take the foundation from the skin, it blends very easily and nicely and also will not make me look like a ghost anymore, so that is a plus. Maybe I just put too much, maybe. Now for concealer, I'm gonna use the e.l.f. Camo Concealer. This one is in the version matte. I bought this in the wrong shade. It's like very light, so I haven't been using it. But because this foundation is already too light, I think it will work. It's a good concealer, but because I bought in the wrong shade, I don't think I use it as much. So we are gonna give a try today. I'm going to use the NYX uh, Sweet Cheeks Blush. Mine is in the shade Baby Doll. I like blending with my hand first, so it's a little bit pigmented than just blending with 
the beauty blender because I feel like the beauty blender just take some of the product out so if you do it with the finger first and then you just lightly blend with the beauty blender just have more pigment and this is a very beautiful shade of blush gonna set my face with the Anastasia Beverly Hills setting powder I'm gonna take the excess of the powder with a fluffy brush I'm gonna use a little bit more bronzer so I'm gonna use the Tarte Amazonian clay bronzer it's one of my favorite powder bronzer is so beautiful And I'm also gonna use a little bit more blush. This one is from ColourPop from the High School Musical Collection. It's the shade Playoffs. Very pretty red pink blush. For highlighter, I'm gonna use this Ibi Beauty. So pretty. Now let's do the eyebrows. I'm gonna use the NYX Lift and Snatch Brow Tinted Pen. For the eyes, I am really into like siren eyes, the tear look. I'm gonna use the KVD Beauty eyeshadow palette. It has some stunning glitter shimmery shades. But first, I'm going to start with this brown eyeshadow here. So a lot of people using the eyelash curler to do this. So I am going to try it out, see how it looks. I don't know, maybe this shadow is too light, so I don't see like a big difference, but it's cool. Somehow they do like a straight version here, I don't know how. I'm just gonna do it with my hands anyway. Now, I think I'm gonna use this shimmer shade right here. I think it's called Levels. And it's very pretty. It has like a dual chrome. Look how pretty! I hope you guys can see the like the, the dual chrome. It's like a reddish green champagne color. It is so pretty. I'm gonna do a brown eyeliner because I don't want black. So I'm just gonna use my eyebrow pen to do that. Although this is very dark. I think I want volume on my lashes, so I'm gonna use the Huda Beauty Legit Lashes and I'm gonna use the side that gives volume. I'm gonna apply a little bit of the brown eyeshadow that I did in my crease 
on my bottle lashes. And on my waterline, I'm gonna use the 1999 eye pencil in the shade Lustre. It's like a um, beige champagne color, really pretty. On the lips, I was thinking about trying the vampy lip trend. So I'm gonna use the MAC Ruby Woo lipstick, very famous. And then I'm gonna contour my lips with the Urban Decay 24 7 eye pencil. Gonna blend out a little bit with a brush. Tell me why the Vampy Lips is actually pretty nice. I really like it. Guys, the sun is gonna be like crazy right now. So if the light's like awful right now, I'm so sorry. But this is the makeup. I feel like so much better right now. Just my voice that's really, really bad. Um, but I really like the eyes. I hope you guys see the dual chrome. It's so, so pretty. And I really enjoyed the lips as well. I thought I wouldn't, but I did. And I think it's really, really cute. Let me know in the comments below what you guys think. If you like this video, give a thumbs up. If you're not subscribed to my channel yet, Please subscribe in the absolute world to me and hit that bell button so you can get notifications on my future uploads. A big kiss and I see you in my next video.